Hello, everybody. My name is Tom Boone. I'm with the Outreach Foundation, and we're here in Istanbul, Turkey, uh, with a group called Rodmard. And uh, do you guys know what Rodmard means yet? I don't. Okay. It's, men's ministry? Well, men's? it's a men's ministry. It means something men's. Man of virtue, man of um, uh, purity. Okay, that that's kind of a rough translation. Uh, and we have been working with, I think, 14 guys, right? 14. Uh, most of them are from Iran. There's a couple who are refugees in Turkey, but most are coming in from Iran. Um, so tell us first off about yourselves. Yeah, my name is Preston. I'm going into my senior year of college at Palm Beach Atlantic University, and I'm studying ministry. My name is Gavin. I'm also a senior at Palm Beach Atlantic, and I'm studying marketing. All right. Okay. And you all are seniors, right? Yes, yeah, sir. Last year. So um, you all uh, have had a lot of experience with Iranians, haven't you? Nope. No. no. First interaction <laughs> this week. So what? So yeah, I put it that way because I, I think it's kind of a great, you know, one of the things that people often hear when they when we bring congregations over is that you're going to go see Iranians. Why would you go do that? Um, so what were some things that maybe you heard coming here, if you heard anything, or and then reflect off of that, maybe what have you learned about these guys? Yeah, I mean, I guess. I really had no clue. To be honest, I probably couldn't have dis been able to like distinct or set differences between any Middle Eastern people, really. Mm. So this is kind of my first interaction with Turkish people or Iranian people in general. So now I'm definitely able to see like the differences between them and their cultures, it's like being in Turkey, but being with Iranians. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I've definitely learned a lot about them, um, the way they love and care for their people the way they brought us in yeah so quickly with hugs and conversations sharing food and stuff like that so it's been really cool that's cool yeah something that i've learned um just from being around them and hearing their stories is the amount of miracles that they get to um kind of witness yeah. i remember one of the guys today was telling his story and that it took him three like huge miracles with his wife and his kid and himself to finally like wrap around the idea of like God is for me and and this is the path I want to go to. So I feel like in our everyday lives in America, there's miracles, but we're not as um, we just don't really look at them as as much as miracles. Um, but the Iranian men that we have been able to encounter this week have their life is full of miracles. And, yeah. Yeah. 